Okay, welcome back, man. 2040 Biz Techno Psychology Thinkcast. And in the Thinkcast, we talk about business, we talk about technology, we talk about psychology. But most importantly, we talk about the procedure. We talk the steps which you can put in the practice to strengthen your game in this corporate world. And today, I'm going to talk how to talk with C-level executive, how to talk with CEO. If you're a salesperson and uh, you got to talk with a CEO or CTO or the C-level executive, then what are those things which you need to think, which you need to take in consideration? I'm sure you know your game. I know, you know, you sell technology. I know you have, uh, you have a wonderful technology. You have a wonderful value proposition, which you can offer to these people. But the question is this, what are those psychological things which you need to take in the practice, which you need to consider the time you're interacting with them? Because these people are authority figures, correct? These people are decision makers. Many people talk to them, they manage team, they manage millions or maybe billions of euros. And uh, in front of them, you are a tiny, you are a tiny, I would say you are a tiny piece, right? So first thing is the time you're talking with the C-level executive, you got to take in consideration that, that they don't have time, they have less time, they are very busy, right they they meet several people every day like you right you need to take this thing in consideration right at the time you are talking with them you need to consider these points right so the time you pitch to them just be very precise very short respect their time but but don't be gentle don't be gentle. If you are a gentle, sir, yes, we can do that. We can build that technology. If you show that gentle side, these people are not going to listen to you. You got to demonstrate as a subject matter expert. You got to demonstrate the expert in your area. And if you are expert, you know what you are talking about. If you're expert, you act, you behave differently, right? You never meet any surgeon, any brain surgeon who become your friend, who start talking with you something very lovey-dovey and being very gentle, uh, polite, etc. You never trust them. You, you talk with the surgeon, you talk with a doctor who knows his game and who is serious, who's very authentic, who knows what he's talking about. So the time you talk to C-level executive, just demonstrate your authority. That's what I'm saying. Demonstrate your authority, right? Don't hold back. Just tell them, call it, sir, listen, we build this technology. This technology can reduce your delivery time up to up to X person, and we can demonstrate you that these are the numbers, right? If you are interested, or, or you might say, if you're inter if 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 it makes sense, if it makes sense, we can organize a call with you. Does is that okay for you? So the time you show expertise, the time you show you know your uh, material, the time you show you are authentic, right? These people will consider you because these people, they meet several people like you every day. They have several people in their organization who are always requesting them, sir, can you do this, that, that, et cetera? And, and if you do that, they will consider you as a normal person. So be authoritative, have authority in your voice. Of course, you must have that strong value proposition to present to them. So three things, be authoritative, be very precise. And third thing is have a strong value proposition. If you have these all three, I'm sure you will win the deal. Thank you.